What's up, everybody? It's Joe from Complex. We're in Las Vegas at Feature with legendary DJ Tiesto. I was in the studio with Post Malone, and he was like, uh, what are those, Carl's Jr. shoes? Uh, gonna do some sneaker shopping today. Gonna see what he's feeling, what he's not, and then hopefully he's gonna buy some sneakers. I would love to. Let's go. Tiesto, what yeah. are some of your favorite models from Adidas? Actually, this is my favorite model. EQTs. EQTs, yeah. I got uh, some special pairs. I got uh, the OG and the Bait, and my favorite is the Overkill. They are super comfortable. Like, I love to DJ in these because they, they give you a lot of support, and they're comfortable and they look cool too. So, Absolutely. It's, it's the perfect combination for me. And now, you know, you're not an athlete, but you are moving around a lot on stage, so function is really important. Very important, because if I wear shoes that I'm not comfortable, I just perform less good. Like, I love to wear boots once in a while, and, but never when I DJ, because it's just... The so day it, after, your, your yeah. ankles are done. I jump around for two hours is, is hard, so these are perfect to that. I mean, most sneakers are, actually. The ones I really don't like is the Triple S Balenciagas. They're so heavy. It's like that. It's, yeah, that's ridiculous. Yeah. It's like, I feel like I have size 50 in those, and that they must be like a kilo each, or uh, yeah. is that two pounds? You know? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> so like, they're too heavy. But okay. They look cool, but they're too heavy. We have the Ultra Boosts. Yeah, I love the Ultra Boosts. Great for working out, too. And they burn very well. Burn, so wait. Physically burned Physically shoes? Physically burned uh, really? a pair of shoes, yeah. Okay, when yeah. did that come about? I, I was just uh, on a road trip somewhere and uh, we had like a campfire and we were running out of wood. And wow. I, I, was, <laughs> I was tired of my shoes, so I put them in there. And, they, and it was uh, a pair of Ultra Boots. It was a pair of Ultra Boots. Wow, <laughs> like good a, to know. Yeah. Want to talk about Kanye, you wear a lot of Yeezys. You're wearing the Wave Runner a lot recently. And you know, you've worn the Calabasas. What do you think about the product that he's doing with Adidas? I think he does a great job at Adidas and uh, the semi-frozen. Yeah, the 350s, yeah. Yeah, the 350s, yeah. The, those are the ones uh, I wear like on the rave. Okay. They're, they're the perfect rave shoes. Uh, and the rave culture is coming back, so. Yeah. Especially in fashion. He's always nailing it like to be ahead of the trends, you know. That's why, that's why he's Kanye. You remix Lost in the World. Have you ever met with him? I had some great interactions with him. Like uh, I met him on the yacht in uh, Saint-Tropez when he just started uh, wow. dating okay. Kim Kardashian. And uh, he was so nice and easy to talk to. I mean, he's, he can be very uh, verbal about yep. everything, but when I met him, he was always really calm and chill. And the most impressive time I met him was actually uh, backstage before the, uh, the Billboard Awards. And he played me the whole new uh, Life of Pablo album. Wow. Like the first time and he was cranking it and P. Diddy was there and everybody was dancing and it was an amazing experience. It was the first time I heard it and I was That's blown awesome. away. Yes, so we obviously had to talk Jordan, global impact. For someone who grew up in another part of the world, what was it like? Do you remember back in the day watching him play? No, not really, because uh, where I'm from, basketball was not that big. So really? It was all about soccer. But when I when I came to America, uh, I, I learned pretty quick about all the sports culture here. I, yeah. I came here in 2001, and since then, you know, all my friends here, they taught me everything about football, your guys' football. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I know, yeah. And, uh, of course, basketball as well. And I, I love Air Jordans, you know, they're, they're, they're just a great shoe. And I love when I do collabs. Yeah, you know, you're wearing the Cause 4, a very yeah. rare collab. Yeah, I, I love those. They're, they're very comfortable and uh, you can, you know, wear with everything. I also like the, the Ricardo Tichy one. Yeah, the Air Force Ones. Yeah, I was in the studio with Post Malone when yeah. he made uh, Jackie Chan. And he was like, uh, what are those Carl's Jr. shoes? Oh, wow, that's funny. <laughs> he he's, a, he's funny, he's yeah, funny. He's really funny, yeah. Now, you once said that you're not thinking about retiring, but when you do retire, you may get into fashion. This was in an interview a couple years back. Still feel the same way? I don't know. I, I mean, I've, I've been investigating a lot in the fashion world and doing my research and uh, it's tough. Yeah. I mean, and especially to go for a long time. There's not many Virgils in this world, you know? It's true. I think he, he just did it this whole life. So I think I'm just born to be a DJ the rest of my life. And I love fashion and I'm, I'm a huge fan of everything. So I just keep in touch with it, but yeah. to, to become a fashion icon like that. But it's... you're a DJ icon, he DJs a lot. He, you know, he's killing the fashion game. Maybe you guys can uh, yeah. trade secrets. We should do a collab or something. Exactly, <laughs> right? Another thing I read 
it said that, you know, you do over maybe 200 dates globally and that you very rarely outfit repeat. Yeah, it's, uh, I get sent a lot of stuff. Okay. And also uh, with my shoes, mm -hmm. like uh, I don't keep my shoes. Okay. So even the rare ones, I always give them away to friends. I only have like five pairs of shoes and the rest I just give away. So yeah, all the shoes you've seen in the past, yeah. I, did, they, I gave them to friends. So whoever has your size, lucky friend. <laughs> lucky friend, yeah, I got some lucky friends. Because I can only travel with two suitcases. And okay. when, it, when they're full, I gotta put some, uh, take some stuff out, you know? Yeah, so you mentioned you bring maybe five pairs of shoes with you on the road. One of them you have in Vegas is a pair of Y3. Yeah. Are they in the rotation a lot? Yeah, they are. Yeah, they're very comfortable so and easy to wear anywhere. We talked about the Ultra Boost. This is kind of like Ultra Boost with the Y3 spin on it. Yeah. How do you feel about high fashion and sneakers crossing over more than ever? I think it's great. It's great for me because I, li I like that combination. Yeah. It's for me the perfect combination. I really like Raph Simmons, you know. Yeah. So. Tons of Raph Simmons oh, over here. Yeah. Yeah, I like this one a lot. It's a little bit like the easy one. Yep. Yeah. It has the wave runner shape for sure. It has sure. the wave runner shape. So I might have to get a pair of this. And then, you know, oh. classic Stan Smiths with Raph, the Raph yeah. Simmons stamps. I don't like the zippers on the sides. Yeah. It's just too uh, much. Yeah. It's too much. Yeah. For me, like I had these in white, but they were not very comfortable. So okay. I, I had to burn those as well. For bigger venues, more special concerts, do you ever bring out more rare footwear or what? Uh, I definitely think, think about it a lot. Yeah. Like at the pool parties, you see my uh, my sneakers a little bit more, so and more summery. At the nightclub, you you see them less, and, right. and, and people are very uh, sloppy at the end of the night, you know, with the drinks and stuff. Absolutely. So most of my shoes get destroyed. Yeah. You know, like they, they spill like champagne on them or vodka Red Bull, and yeah, they, yeah, yeah. they're destroyed. So yeah, it's just it happens. So Tiesto, we talked about everything. Now's the easy part: get the browser shells, pick up some sneakers. Let's do it. Like these, oh, uh, oh, can't go wrong. All black. These are cool. The back. I like this one. Alexander Wang. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta get my load up on EQTs. So sure. this is perfect. Oh, and this one. Nice. You know what? I think I got a few more upstairs. I need to get. Sounds good. Let's okay. check it out. Let's do it. I need a pair of the white threes. Last but not least. The Raph Siemens. Nice, as we go. That's a wrap, let's take it. Let's do it. All right, man, your total today is gonna be uh, 3904.58. All right. Amazing. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Have a good one. Yeah, party time. So, Tiesto, thanks so much for coming through. As you guys saw, bought a lot of sneakers, told some great stories. Make sure you check out his new single, Jackie Chan, streaming everywhere right now.